Smith says, move your fucking ass. Bottom feeder. Never play this live. If you know it, sing it. Help me. Help me.
the Acacia Strain from Albany, New York. Thank you guys for being here tonight on Wormwood Night. Tonight's called Wormwood Night because they're playing an album, an album called Wormwood. The whole record. Who's the fuck? Whose idea was that? Nobody wants to hear a whole record. Do you want to hear a whole record? It was your idea. You sons of bitches. Bumpuses. You guys having a good time so far? Where's Lance? Where's Lance? Where's Lance? He fucked up. I was supposed to play dice with someone on stage, but he's, Lance isn't here with the dice. I got dared. I got dared to play dice. There he is. Who wants to play dice against me on, right now? Give me the dice, fucker. You have a dollar? I'm using his money. What is that? You want me to play with a tw your fucking 20? I will pay you back, but $20 if you lose? Who wants in? What is this? What do you got? That's a dollar. He's got a dollar. One dollar. All right, right here, right here. You, you know how to play CeeLo? No? He has no fucking idea. That means I get to go first. 
What you have to do is, I can't see shit. What you have to do is you have to get two numbers and then the number that doesn't match those numbers is the number that you you have, okay? So say I got, see I just got a five because I got two ones and a five. So you have to beat five. He's got a three. He's got a three, he loses. That's Lance's though. It's okay. Thank you for being a good sport. Now you just learned how to play a new game and lose money, but you just lost a dollar. It's not that big of a deal. Lance, this is your money. You just won, man. I won for you. Give it up for 200 stab wounds. Take these dice. I don't want these. Give it up for what's your, what's your name? What is your name? Your name. Shane. Shane? Shane. Give it up for Shane for being a good sport. I want to thank I want to thank 200 Stab Wounds for being on like eight of these shows, nine of these shows. Give it up for fucking, give it up for 200 Stab Wounds. Oh my God. They're from here, so if you haven't heard their name yet, you fucked up. If you missed the 200 Stab Wounds set, you fucked up. Next time, check them out. One of the best fucking death metal bands I've ever played with in my entire life. 200 Stab Wounds. All right. We're gonna keep playing songs off the Wormwood record. If you know this, if you know the words, sing along. If you don't, act like you do. It doesn't fucking matter. We're just here to have a good time. This song, you should. You, this song, you can either you can either hit the pit or you can headbang. Nothing else. Nothing more. Nothing less. Hit the pit. Headbang. This is called Terminated. when weed smells like popcorn.
This is honestly, I swear to God, it's one of the better, the be, one of the best shows of this entire tour is in this room right now. I'm not fucking with you. I'm not pandering. I'm serious. Uh, I want to thank you all for being here. This it means a lot because you're playing songs that are fucking as old as a fifth grader. Some people not by, might might be as receptive, but you all wanted this, so thank you for being here tonight and having a good time. Thank you. Thank you. 11 years, 11 years is a long time. I'm sure you can all vouch for the existence of time and the fact that it, 11 years is a long increment as far as human beings are concerned. A lot can happen in 11 years. A lot has happened to me in the past 11 years. I've grown, I've changed, I've learned, I've, uh, I've, I've lost, and uh, I think I'm a better person now because of all of that. Um, I hope, I hope, I hope no one in this, in this room is the same exact person as they were 11 years ago. Stagnance is, is no good. You have to, you have to move forward. You have to go upwards. And it's sometimes, sometimes it's upwards like this and it's a rocky road. Uh, but, but you get better. You learn, you grow, you change. And that's what matters. I wrote, a, I, I had a, I had a hard time. 11 years ago, I was in a rough spot in my life. I was angry, I was depressed, I was sad, I was just negative all the time, and it was for no real reason. So I started writing stuff down, I started writing down words, and those words became lyrics, and those lyrics became songs, and those songs made it onto an album called Wormwood. And uh, I, think, I think learning how to channel my anger into something that is somewhat positive really helped me as a human being, and it helped me uh, down a path that led me to the person I am today. So if you're having a hard time, if you're sad, if you're lonely, if you're depressed, if you're, if you're angry, if you're anything negative, uh, try and figure out why. Try and figure out a way to take that, all that negative energy and turn it into something good. Because the world is already shitty enough. We don't need more shitheads. We need more better people. We need more good people. We need more, we just need more good. The world fucking sucks. I know, we're all here. We lived the past two years. That shit was the worst. And it's, it still sucks. It's not getting any better. The only thing we can do is try and better ourselves singularly and maybe pass it along to other people. And, uh, and that's what I did. So if, if, if you're feeling that, if you need help, don't be afraid to ask because that's, that's the hardest part is, is, is being afraid to, is, is, is asking other people for help because it might feel weird. There's a stigma that goes around with, with all this, but don't be afraid to reach out to your friends, your family, and just talk to them and tell them what's going on. And if you're on the, if you're on the receiving end of that, don't be afraid to help your fucking friends. Don't be afraid because you could be the person that changes, changes everything. You could be the last, the last wall between that person and total mental collapse. So please help your fucking friends if they reach out to you. And if you need help, don't be afraid to ask. Uh, be kind, be good. It's, fu it's really fucking hard. It took me 11 plus years to even realize that I needed to do anything. So be kind, be good, and, 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 and start down that kind of weird path. Uh, this song is about the exact opposite 
of everything that I just said. I'm so, uh, kind of a hypocrite, but if you know the words, sing along, smile, and, uh, and, 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 try and try and rip someone's face right off of their body. This is called Jonestown.
pig of humanity. Just because you're breathing. Just because you're breathing. Music man, now you're alive. Just because you're human. Music man, you will to die. See? the acacia strain i've been coming to cleveland for a long time i said it yesterday but i mean it's serious like we've been i've been to cleveland almost every year for the past 19 or so years minus last year cleveland is is familiar as fuck to me i recognize a lot of faces in this crowd i appreciate you guys coming back again and again and again and just believing in what this band does and, and appreciating what we do and supporting what we do because without you there is no us there is no such thing as the acacia strain if it weren't for you guys so thank you thank you our goal for this entire tour is to just bring bring people into the uh, room together because a lot of us haven't been in a room with human beings in a very long time and kind of reoriginate you with humanity and, uh, and like-minded individuals, and I want everybody to have a wonderful time. I want people to make memories. I want people to meet new, meet new friends and, and, uh, and, and, and hook back up with old friends and people you haven't seen for a long time and just enjoy yourselves. And, cause we know, we don't, I didn't, we didn't fucking plan the coronavirus. We don't fucking, we had no idea. That shit came out of left field, hit us in the face and we went, oh shit, what the fuck are we gonna do now? So now mu live music is back. We wanna keep it back. We don't want that shit to happen again. But just in case it does, just in case it does, just in case something worse happens or, or something catastrophic happens, we need to live right now. We need to live for this moment right now. We need to remember this moment right now. So make memories, have fun, give somebody a high five and, uh, and just have a good fucking time. If this is your first Acacia Strain show, uh, I want you to stage dive for this song. If this, if you've never staged dove before, I want you to stage dive for this song. There's a bunch of people in the front row right here that will fucking catch you. They've been doing a great job all goddamn night. So if you, if this is your first experience with the Acacia Strain, stage dive. If you've never staged dove before, try it right now. I'm not asking. I'm demanding. Get the fuck up here and jump off the stage. This is called Carpathian. 
Jumper be jumped on, you fucking virgins! Shut up!
I didn't say fun. For 200 stab wounds.
your eye out, kid. That's Wormwood. Thank you. We're not done. We're not done. We have more songs. That's just one record. We got a whole other back catalog of records before that one. We'll play some more. We'll play some more. You guys having a good time? So, do you want us to play more? I don't even know. We could just stop right now. That would be fine with me. Thank you. Thank you. I want to thank, I want to thank the city of Cleveland for existing. Uh, when I was a... When I was a teenager, Cleveland was like this mythical place to me because bands like Integrity, Integrity and Ringworm came from here and it was like the mecca of metallic hardcore when I was a child, when I was a teen. Even into adulthood, I was like, Cleveland is the fucking, that's the place to be if you want to write a metallic uh, hardcore record. So I want to thank, I want to thank the city of Cleveland for birthing Integrity, for birthing Ringworm, for, for, for helping this band come into existence. Devin's from Ohio. Our merch guy, Ollie's from Ohio. He doesn't want to talk about it anymore because he doesn't like being he from here anymore. He moved to California, but he's from Ohio. He's, a, he's a born and bred from, an, from Ohio. I want to thank you guys for always coming, always showing up, always being here from Peabody's to now. Thank you very much for always being one of the best fucking cities to play. And I swear to God, the best fucking cities to play in the entire world, Cleveland, Ohio. Thank you very fucking much. From the bottom of my heart, I appreciate you. We're going to play some old songs now, some old songs for some old people from Pirate's Cove to now. If you're, if, you're, if you're over 30 and you're not in the pit, I'm revoking your adult card. You've got to go back to being a teenager. Get up here and move around. Have fun. Stage dive, circle pit. It's called Dr. Doom.
Push them back! Push them back! Ow, 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 ow.